And we've talked about how experience is the best teacher out there, but what does it take past the experience? What do you have to do with that experience to make it teach you something worthwhile? And the answer is you have to reflect on what has occurred and what you tried there, right? We talk about it a ton when we, when we cold call and we're going through our process. So we have a very structured five-step process for that first cold call to a decision maker. And at the end of that call, we should be breaking down that call and, and reflecting on what tools did I use? What did I forget to use? Did I control the call and keep it in that five-step flow that gets me into a good closing cycle? Or did I let the prospect or the decision maker drive that call and push me off? So at the end of the day, reflection is how you do that. You've got time for 10, 15, 30 seconds of reflection after every decent call of the decision maker. And if it was a longer call and you, you uncovered some great things, a little bit more reflection will help you there. But if you're just hitting the phones and nothing's happening and you're not thinking about what, what could have gone better or what will I do next time, then you're not using that experience to learn from. And that takes reflection to make sure you get there.